In this video, we'll take a look at whether NaOH plus HCl is endothermic or exothermic. So when we mix sodium hydroxide plus hydrochloric acid, is the reaction an endothermic reaction or an exothermic reaction? So let's take a look at the chemical reaction that takes place. So in our reaction here, we have could be solid or aqueous sodium hydroxide and then aqueous hydrochloric acid. We mix these together. Sodium hydroxide, that is a base, probably one you should remember. Hydrochloric acid, that's, well, it's an acid. So we have hydrochloric acid, sodium hydroxide. We mix them together, we get an ionic compound, we call that a salt, and then we get water. So when we have a base and an acid, they mix together, get a salt and water. That is a neutralization reaction. And neutralization reactions, they're exothermic. So NaOH plus HCl, that's gonna be exothermic. So when this reaction happens, heat's going to be released into the surroundings, the glass of the beaker, the water, and the temperature of the surroundings, the glass and the water, it's going to increase. We say that it has a negative delta H, so it has a negative enthalpy. If we look the enthalpy up for this reaction here, we'd have negative 57.9, and the units would be kilojoules per mole. So each mole would release negative 57.9 kilojoules of heat. Finally, the products of the reaction, these compounds right here, they'll have a lower energy than these here. We lost that heat energy, so these will have a lower energy. This is Dr. B answering the question whether NaOH plus HCl is endothermic or exothermic. It is exothermic. Thanks for watching.